Welcome, foolish mortals. Going to show you a quick video of some of the most recent pops that I've picked up. Um, I'm going to start packing pops away, and I'm going to do it by getting some bigger boxes, and then I'll do videos of each box as I'm putting it away. I need some room for my normal collection, so I'm going to start putting these pops away. Um, the newer stuff I'm going to keep out for a little while, but we'll go from there. So first up is Cobb Vance. I have not yet found a chase version of him without his helmet, which sucks a lot. But you can see all of them that were in that wave. And I've got all of them, I think. Problem with how many pops I have is I don't have a good way to inventory them anymore because the site I used to use shut down and I can't trust the Funko one to upload properly. I got the new Apollo Creed for the Rocky 45th anniversary. And they did Rocky and Apollo, of course. Then I got Mr. Gruberson from Ghostbusters Afterlife. I keep I found all the kids today, but I have not bought them yet. But I do need to. More from Star Wars is Cad Bane with Toto 360. He's back there in the bottom. You can see him. It's very cool. I was very happy to find him. Finnick Shand from The Mandalorian and The Book of Boba Fett and The Bad Batch. And of course, Mr. Boba Fett with all his armor pretty much cleaned up. Still some scuffs here and there, but he's been into he's been in the wars a little bit. So do like that one. And then a new Masters of the Universe, Terror Claw Skeletor, which is a Target exclusive. It's all shiny. I picked up the Elvis. Pure gold. I like these. I want to pick up a couple more, uh, especially the Queen ones. I wish they'd do an Elton John one. That'd be cool. And then this is from Star Trek II. This is a uh, spoiler alert. This is how Star Trek II ends. This is Kirk and Spock in the Wrath of Khan. It's a very cool, a little better look at him. I don't like how close Luke, um, Kirk's face is to the glass because you can't remove these figures. So they're just kind of there. And then last week I did open up this Rudolph uh, Funko Soda. Unfortunately, he came broken. So his ear is snapped off. So he's even more of a misfit than he ever was. This is actually the first Funko item I've ever gotten that was broken. And when I got it, um, his ear is down in there with his pog. But I do have small Funko Sodas coming. And... I, I try not to buy more Funko, but you know me, I'm probably going to anyway. So, uh, thanks for sticking around. Till next time, catch you on the flip side.